Good evening. Hundreds of jobs are understood to be at risk at the West Yorkshire headquarters of the supermarket chain Asda. Now, the company said this morning that it's facing some difficult decisions as the industry faces major challenges. Phil Bodmer is live in Leeds for us now. Phil, what's the company been saying? Well, Harry, Asda says these are challenging times, and indeed it's been a difficult day for the staff employed here at Asda House on the banks of the River Eyre. The company says it's under intense pressure from the internet and also the discounters like Aldi and Lidl, and all it's really doing is reacting to the changing circumstances. Some 3,000 people are employed at Asda's Leeds head office. The BBC understands around 300 positions are likely to go under plans to alter the way it does business. The company, which is owned by the American-based Walmart Group, says radical changes to consumer shopping habits has left them with little choice, a sentiment echoed by retail analysts. Organisations like Aldi and Lidl have come into the marketplace who offer brilliant transparent pricing and Asda is really starting to lose their way in who they are and what they stand for. Every organisation that's struggling needs to make itself as lean as possible and that means you've got to take away that weight of management structure that isn't perhaps needed and make sure that you don't have those big wage overheads trying to make you as efficient as possible for what's going to be a challenging future in this marketplace. Asda have got to again work out what they're going to do to set their position not just for this year but but ongoing, trying to win customer loyalty and make sure the customers keep coming back. And I'm afraid the old adage of best value just doesn't really stand for anything anymore. They've got to be more than that to the consumer to make sure they get this footfall. Asda says it's already begun talks with staff who may be directly affected. The total number of job losses will not be made public until employees have been fully informed.